Let us leave this place. Happily. <laughs> Better. I can feel things getting more normal already. Wait. That tree. Well, isn't that interesting? What is this? That's the noose, brother. The one Odin hanged himself with. As part of his endless mad quest for secrets of life and death and what have you. What are you doing? It's a charged object, significant to Odin. Perhaps I'll find a use for it. Brother, what they said about the boy... Will not happen. Oh, I agree. It will not happen. We will not let it. Of course we bloody won't. The question is how. You wouldn't seriously consider killing Heimdall, would you? I will do what I must. Oh, is that all? You're wrong to dissuade him, Amir. You know Heimdall. I grant you that he's a spiteful, vicious little shit. And so loyal, Odin entrusted him with Galahorn. If we have the chance to eliminate him before Ragnarok, we shouldn't hesitate. Considering his powers of foresight alone, that is an if of mountainous size. Even supposing we're all perfectly comfortable plotting an assassination, and I, for one, am a mite rusty at that measure, we've got no way to reach Heimdall, and no way to kill him if we did. I have killed gods greater than him. I don't doubt that, brother, but it's hardly my point. I think we're missing the Norn's message here. We've all got our tendencies, and yours is to run headlong into danger to protect the ones you love. I do not intend to change. Not about that. Why should you? Apparently my tendency is to kill the ones I love. Freya... I don't need you to comfort me. Either of you. Their accusation was cruel. None of us believe... The truth can be a cruel thing. Anyone care to argue with that? No. But Baldur's fate had many causes. Prophecy among them. How do you mean, brother? There are many tales in my homeland of those who fulfilled prophecy by attempting to avoid it. So it was when Freya tried to protect Baldur. And so it was when I accused my son of going to Asgard. Then we agree. It'd be foolish to go after Heimdall. No. If Heimdall must die for Atreus to live, then Heimdall must die. How can you say that, knowing what you know? Because if Heimdall is a threat to my son, I must act. It is my... Your nature. Well played, Norns. <laughs>
As I was saying, tales of time trap. Let us find a gateway. Return home. Consider our plans. Listen, brother. Before you make any hasty decisions, why don't you blow off a little steam? I'm sure there was some loose end we meant to circle back to. <laughs> Give your mind a little time to process everything. I suspect there's unfinished business here at the lake. Now, just because you've got new armor doesn't mean you should let yourself get knocked around more. Very well. Power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah. The inevitable asking of the dwarves. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? What's to be done? Magic Draco, I will speak with you. What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain, and as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the Lindworms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of lean work will be a walk in the park. Anyhow... About Nithog. You should know. We had no choice. It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no expecting him to clean up after himself. Not all gods showed the interest that you do in righting past wrongs. I do hope you're able to locate those lean worms. Good luck to you. Until we meet again. Back. They're back. Simmer down. I see them. I have news. Oh. Did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages. I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri, go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need it. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... 
It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do, but... Go fetch Dropnir. I can't fathom what they have in mind, but if it's a weapon against Heimdall, we can use it. Dropnir? I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Dropnir. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. Our will has helped me kill Heimdall. Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artistes. But to even store Dropnir, you need... You were saying... Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought, I understand my son is in danger. Odin's left hand, and he carries the cord. Begins Ragnarok. <laughs> Chance to eliminate him. And it's just as likely a trap because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Whew. Whew. That's a relief. <laughs> huh? Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. The lady? No idea what he's on about, brother. I'm only just realizing all the little routines I've had to... See you out there. Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh, no! This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock will go. What? No, no, no. You I have to. heard him. Quit your friend. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What was all that then? Oh, just Sentry trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. 
What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in need of a Lear been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursioning you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates said never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so colorfully. Keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. for liquor and explosives. Little on the nose for dwarven culture, isn't it? Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic ace. an abandon. oil spill. Kratos! Kratos! Oh. 
Sindri, is that you? Yes. I need to talk to Kratos. Please listen. You have to let me take Brock's place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But... Oh dear. It's not his fault Atreus ran off, you know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again. You're insinuating and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. <laughs> These gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. The sigil arrows should work with ice as well. sort of grim. These won't be easy tunnels for the dwarves to take back. We'll need to get one of those gates open. That worked. Shall we? This opinion of yours, was that the reason you proposed this alliance? You expect me to lead your armies at Ragnarok. That is Tyr's job, not mine. It's plain to see Tyr's no war god anymore. Nor am I. I have left that life behind. Not killing gods you haven't. Or else what are we doing in this realm? Forging this weapon? Your choice. You know where it might lead. I am only protecting I my... know. I know. And we both know the places protecting your child can take. Sigil arrows won't work on this. Oh! <laughs> 
Now, where have they got the third one hidden away? <laughs> until we stun them. was a giant, isn't that right? She was one of the Yotnar. Yes. I didn't mean she was tall as a house. I, I know not all giants are giants. Not that there's anything wrong with a disparity in size. Or number of limbs, see? Nothing in the world. There. Now we can open the other gate. Why is it you ask? I was just thinking of how Odin antagonized the giants for generations. Nearly wiped them out of existence twice. Now you may have a role to play in stopping him once and for all. Don't you think it's possible that's what your wife would have wanted? Do not presume to know what she wanted. I'm not saying anything you haven't thought. Her secret on every step of your path, wasn't it? Maybe if you talked about your doubts, they wouldn't explode when you talk to your son. I do not doubt. She knows what I left behind. She would never have asked that of me. Why would she need to ask? She saw your face. Three of Odin's kin dead because of the path she put you on. You don't think she knew exactly what it meant, sending you to Jotunheim? This is mere conjecture and probably quite enough of it, Highness. We're all making an effort to cooperate here, after all. You're right. It's not for me to say. All right. Let's get that wheel turning. <laughs> Brother, don't give up. I'm certain we can get that gate open. <laughs> That's a start.
Well, who's ready for some fresh air after that? Everyone thought so. It is close. I can feel it. I wasn't trying to provoke you or cast doubt on your marriage. It just seems to me your thoughts haven't caught up to your instincts yet. When we get out of here, I'll give you some space. Let you think carefully about whether you're ready for what it means to make this weapon. And to use it. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'll see what else I can learn while we're here. Maybe I'll send a few Ain Hair Yar back to Valhalla for good measure. Well, you have fun now. Hey, you made it! About time. I got everything all set here. Now we just gotta push on up to the fort. Falky! Well, you sure did go to pains coming here, busting old tear loose. What a prize he turned out to be, huh? Loosed it up and it's time to steal my kitchen, though. Better take out that net, or it'll be eyeball city down here. No! No! These mutts? No wonder they shut the door. No! 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 Hang on, almost got it. Hey. Well, come on in, stranger. You never do get used to that trick. Locals up ahead. Act civilized, and hopefully nobody springs an alarm. No, what you're nattering, you snake sucking mommy milk sauce with your protective gear. Ain't you never seen a legend in the flesh before? Well, that ain't no good. You see what's wrong here, don't you? Those creepy flying eyeballs made a nest up on the cables. We gotta figure a way up there and clear them all. Okay, looks like that wheel up there opened the gate. Not that we can reach it or The dwarves of the camp were twice as alarmed to see Brock than they were to see you. They did seem surprised. All right. Now I can oh. plan to trap that guy. You just give me this thing. 
Now. On it. He is dead. We gotta have a whole stop. Hey, Turn it! I copy that! Look around! Find an angle! Ain't this what you do? What? If the angle you needed to find down there, you'd have found it already. Turn it again! Aye, aye! We need a new vantage point, brother. Once more. Aye, aye! Can we get up any higher from here? Again. <gasps> ah, promising. They seen us. Finally, now we can ride on up to the fort. Come on, the lady's waiting. Hey, got another riddle for you. What gets bigger the more you take away from? Well, let's see. Something abstract, I expect. Appetite? No, that doesn't work. <laughs> stomp the stomp. <laughs> oh, isn't that clever? Bam, pot. Ooh, that's brisk. Think I'll grab some for the lady. Grab some what? The wind? No, you idiot. The sound of the wind. Oh, watch and learn. See? Dwarven magic's all about the intangibles. The relationship between the stuff what you can touch and what you can't. It's about understanding. Understanding what? The nature of a thing's more important than the form of a thing. <laughs> Hang on! I smell trouble. Hey, Bumpier! Come on! Lady, then. 
Lady of the Forge. Ain't a more magical creature in this whole realm. Why, I've been waiting for my chance to meet her since I was knee-high to a Noken. But Sindri had never had it. <laughs> said her. But today's finally the day. Woo! I got goosebumps on my bunions. <laughs> my bro, I've never seen you so... Reverend. Are you nervous? What? Shut up. No, fuck you. <laughs> It does not work. Huh? What is it this time? Oh, fuck no. Do I gotta fix everything in this dang city my own self? I'm gonna need a couple of things. Follow me. Yeesh, this place ain't in some disrepair. It's disrespectful, I tell you. I need that axe of ours to go kiss that material out yonder. The spiky silvery stuff. You'll figure it out. This lady, what does she do? Well, we'll both see soon enough, won't we? I know this, though. If we're real lucky, she'll give us her blessing. Doesn't give them to every piece, but the one she does, there's something to behold. The axe? Well, that particular process was a whole nother cluster, huh? Maybe sometime I'll spin you that tail. Faye's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. Now I need a chunk of that bronze material over by all that busted up wood. Back in those days, I'd get so caught up in trying to be the best that I'd work till I boom drop. Time goes by and there's less to prove. You learn to keep your own pace. Save your extra effort for when it's personal. Like for when you finally get to show the lady who you are. Wow, Goaty, you sure did give up on that riddle in a hurry. I give up nothing. Gets bigger the more you take away, is it? That's right! Hmm, sorted. It's desire. Nope! What do you mean, nope? Desire only grows when you take away the thing you desire. All right, it's not perfect, but let's hear your answer. Oh, you won't get it out of me that easy. <laughs> All right, let's get back to business. One more crank to turn and it's onto the forge. I see no forge. You don't see the form of a forge, but we're going to the nature of one. I was almost following him for a moment there. We're good! Crank it!
afraid you're almost forgot. Ma'am, it would be an honor if you might bless you for this. Are you, uh... Hello? Hello? What the fuck was that? She acts like I weren't even here. Mermaids don't speak to our corporeal bodies. They speak to a part of our soul. A part specifically you might be missing. Fuck! Damn it, Sindri, you lion stab scrubber! I knew it. I died. I fucking died! <laughs> The fuck you want? It needs a blessing. Yeah, well, the one to give us the blessing just fucked off into the tomb. It needs the blessing of a great blacksmith. What? No, no, I can't bless shit. I don't have all my soul bits. It, the blessing wouldn't mean squat. It is the nature of a thing that matters. Not its form. All right. May this weapon strike true. May it be wielded with wisdom. May it be put down when its job is done. You know I can't let you take our meat down. Look! We got volunteers! That's the stuff! Ain't your first time with the spear, I reckon! It is the first weapon a Spartan learns. What hell? Ain't this just like old times? Put it more forebodingly myself. what you said back there. It's good to have friends when you find out your brother's a rack scabbing liar. No doubt he only wished to protect you. Weren't his call to make. If the guy dies, he's got the right to know about it. Take heart, Brock. We all die sometime. Many of us more than once. No, never mind all that. We gotta finish putting the spirit through our paces. Come on! Might have to get creative. Get your ruined arm in here! Right 
side incoming! bigger the more you take away. Ah, is it time? Because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No, as bollocks <laughs> now that I say it. Never mind. <laughs> Today's all right. Still my fault. Taking over the grill. We better beat him out. You! Yeah! Hit me already! No weak spots down here, but you keep looking. Good! Guess you get extra credit. One of these hogs' children! Put that in the trap! Great! You got him! Oh, hello there. Sorry, didn't mean to scare you or anything. You did not. Right. Uh, you can bring that back to Ratatoskr whenever you're ready. down there in the forge with the lady that's my story to tell all right agreed well for a period of time perhaps Mamiya. oh very well these are great parts maybe those grim will take you down Oh! <laughs> 
I see a shorter path. Aye. Shall we let Brock improve your gear before we go? Now you'll be getting down from up here. Best I find my own way back. It's too awkward. Only hope Sindri's in one piece by the time Brock's done with him. The ice beneath those two is thin enough under the best of circumstances. Speaking of which, imagine my surprise when Atreus came knocking at my door. <laughs> He's doing well, by the way, and will continue to do so just as long as I return to Asgard sometime soon. Besides, my friend here has a, has a whole lot to live for. Arguable. Run along now, but behave yourself. <sighs> New spear. Never much cared for Brock. Can't deny the dwarf's talent. You came to speak. Speak. You don't really want war. Do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands, on your son's hands. I want peace as much as you do. Perhaps we can find it together. He's lying. I know. That boy of ours. He's everything I expected. So clever. Kind. Be sure he's yours. A kid. You really ought to be very proud. He is the key to peace in our age. To break free. From all this fate and prophecy. My son is not your key. Oh, God, do they not have metaphor in your homeland? Or rather, did they? No, I'm sorry, that's not fair. I know you're not the god you once were. And now is your chance to prove it. Return my son, or you may meet the god I once was. And what kind of god is that? Kratos, what do you even know of godhood? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? 
Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! You don't care about mortals. You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. You fear what you can never even hope to understand. Is it any wonder that your boy is in no rush to come back to you? Don't worth it, brother. He's just trying to get in your head. Superior bastard. That nerve of him showing up here. At least you rattled him as much as he rattled you. Good timing. Let's see what Brock made you. Careful, brother. You're covered in bite rock. So that's the weapon? A drop near spear? A drop near spear. Well, any given number of drop near spears, I suppose. <sighs> Come on, I found a gate. We just need to take the train down. I do worry, though, if I'm being frank. We've crafted a weapon to kill a god. One could say you're on the verge of returning to form. Does it scare you, aiding another violent god? I'm scared for you, brother. That spear could start a war. THE war. If that no longer concerns you, then maybe Freya's right. Maybe the Giants had you in mind all along. So this drop near Spear, you're prepared to use it? To protect Atreus. I am no one's champion but his, nor no one's god. That may be my form. It is not my nature. Do you understand? 
I guess a difference of opinion is hardly the most I'm setting aside for this alliance. As long as the plan is to kill Heimdall, the rest matters little. There's also the bit of news that Odin has some inkling of what we're up to. I thought I heard Ravens. Damn it. What did he say? Lies, threats, and more lies. What did you expect? You think he lies that Atreus is in Asgard? No. On that, I'm afraid I believe him. Then the rest matters little. I saw a gateway near here, overlooking the bay. We can get to it with your spear, I think. This way. That gravestone. There's a keyhole that looks to fit the hilt you found. Hold on. Prepare for battle. After the fuel of Kala. The king! Bag. You knew this warrior. Do me a favor, brother. You see any more of these ghostly berserker tossers, give them the same. You'll be doing the Nine Realms a favor. Did these warriors wrong you at some point, Mimir? You're quite agitated, even for you. No need to rehash ancient history if it's all the same to you. Very well. Big guy. Speak. Need you to get something for me. A hammer. A weapon. No. A forge hammer. Little thing. Symbol of the old resistance. Yield, solidarity, all that. Or it used to be anyway, till the Aesir buried it under that big gaudy dwarf statue in the bay. Might do the dwarves some good to see it again. You're not worried that might draw the Ain Haryar's attention? The old father nearly slit my throat just to get to you. I might be past giving a shit what he thinks. Just find me at the bar when you've got it. You'll certainly be able to reach new areas in the bay with that spear. Aye. Might be worth looking for Darlin's hammer while we're at it. Your choice, of course.
Now that you have a weapon to deal with Heimdall, we just need to find a way to get to him. Aye, if that's still the plan. It is. I will protect my son. So, then it seems the original plan to avoid Ragnarok has fallen a bit by the wayside. That is up to Odin. Yes, that's rather what concerns me. Listen, brother. Those things he said to you... His words are nothing. True. Though I expect retaliation is no empty threat. We need to think through the ins and outs of it. You're getting ahead of yourself. Let's see if Sindri has had any luck. See what we done. Now do the thing. Oh, look at that. She's special, that one. Ain't got to tell me. Have you found a way to reach Asgard? Um, not as such. Had a few ideas, but they didn't so much work. Brother, without a way to Asgard, what are we doing? I do not know. I need to think. I am tired. So, you're sure nothing unusual happened with the lady? Nothing at all? Nothing whatever. Smooth as snail shit, like you said. Where are you going, brother? Sleep. So, we're just keeping blindly on then. Hoping we don't walk headlong into Ragnarok. Is that your plan?
Well, your father seems very ready to go. Shall we then? This way, Grumbles. Do you enjoy the gentle waves, little one? Your father and I traverse this river often. One day, you will learn to navigate its waters. We live deep in the wild woods. The most beautiful forest in all of Midgard. It is safe and serene here. Game is plentiful, and you will want for nothing. I'm not far from the place your father and I first met. We nearly took each other's heads off. But he's softened since then. Somewhere. Unfortunately for you, he remains dreadfully stoic. I suppose it will fall to me to teach you language. Your father can teach you to hunt. Or perhaps that will fall to me as well, since all he seems to be good for is grunting. Have you nothing to say to your son? Do you have me say, Faye? Anything. Let him learn your voice. Let him know you. He is far better off knowing as little as possible. Knowledge is not always a burden. To <laughs> think. The mighty god of war. Frightened of his own child. I do not fear our child, Faye. I fear for him. He is innocent. We are not our failures. We are not who we were. We must be better. Atreus is our future. Keep him safe, Kratos. Protect our son.
would that wall ever do to you? Um, building focus. Something my father taught me. <laughs> Did it work? Not yet. So, what you focusing on anyway? Controlling my emotions. Heimdall keeps trying to make me lose my cool. I can't give into it. Hey, it's true. Hey, it's true. Hey, it's true. Training without me? <laughs> that a that a good idea? Training? I mean, I, I think it's a great idea, but uh, won't your mom be mad if she finds out? Good point. But did you consider? Oh, no, it didn't. It didn't hurt. Also. Mm -hmm. Anyways, grandfather wants to see you. Oh. Grandfather, right, okay, uh, here, then take this, and, uh, send my regards to Sif, Lady Sif, and, uh, Trace. see you later, Throod, bye, Throod. <laughs> Midgardian boys are so weird. Weird can be good. The two of you, as well. What's in the jar? Milk curd. Mom's favorite. It's his way of helping. Grandfather's in the study. Catch up later? It's a lot more complicated than you think. You don't need to know why things... But I'm old enough. This isn't about your age. Then what is it about? Because by this point, Magni and Modi... Were set on the path that led to their death. I don't understand. You never try to. Then help me. Why are you so intent to walk the same path? And with that boy, no less. It's not about him. I just... This is my dream. Haven't you ever? You're not some farmhand. We're Aesir. We have duties, not dreams. And you need to start acting like it. Sometimes I hate you. <laughs> huh. Out of here. Maybe Odin's down in this library. I just don't get it. The mask, bringing the giant that killed my sons here. Why? <laughs> I can explain it to you, but I can't understand it for you. Stop letting a wife think for you. She's clouding whatever's left of your brain. This isn't about her. No, it's about your limitations. Accept them and move on. Now go smash something, will you? Honestly, I like you better as a drunk. Loki, come here. Figured it out. This is where you killed Amir, isn't it? First giant. Tell me, can you murder a landslide, smother a storm? It was more a force of nature, a vessel of power. I was young, foolish, saw an opportunity to create something more. I know you think it's cruel, but I did what I had to. To protect my own. Why build your house here? What's in there? I'm gonna trust shh, you. Shh, shh. I'm trying to tell you. In the wake of Amir's death, I saw something. The rift. Possibly the birthplace of reality. I looked inside and something was there looking back at me. It whispered to me. Things I couldn't possibly comprehend, but I knew they were true. 
when it blinded me, I thought it was over, that I'd never see inside again. And then I found this. And I knew that it would finally let me see the answers. You see, son, I don't know where I go when I go. There's no Valhalla for me. Ragnarok cannot be the end. I need to know there's something more than this. I need to know what happens to me. And that's the truth, I swear, on my last good eye. That's the truth. The writing on here talks about a cold breath. Breath, wind. It's gotta be Helheim. Helheim, you say? I'll take it. And I know just the person to accompany you. I'm trusting you two can handle this responsibility. You can count on us. Don't mess this up for me. Oh, I uh, forgot to mention. Heimdall will be joining you. What a privilege. For all of us. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. You don't want to walk into the blistering cold of Helheim without this. Every Lau should keep you nice and toasty. You're welcome. Huh? The mere said even Odin couldn't survive the cold in Helheim. You believe everything that old goat says? Rude. Too bad your first time outside Asgard has to be to Helheim. Nah, we're gonna make the most of this. Now, as much as I would love to babysit, I have something else to do for the Allfather. If you run into any trouble, just scream so I know where to find your bodies. Let's find that mask piece. Finally, I can test my skills alongside the real Valkyrie expert. First off, Hellwalkers are nothing compared to Valkyries. Second, I thought you didn't believe me. Here's your chance. For the record, I believe you fought the Valkyries. I just don't believe it was Grandfather who corrupted them, or that he caused the desolation in Midgard, or that he had all the giants killed. Am I missing anything? Uh, lots, actually. <laughs> What? You're just supposed to watch? No way! Loki, watch out! I gotta say, I don't think these warriors are very hard to beat. Well, what other heinous crimes has my grandfather committed? Let's see. He decimated Vanahan, tortured Tyr, Murdered Groa, murdered Amir. It goes on and on. Interesting. And where'd you hear all this? Freya and Amir told me. Oh, so his traitorous ex-wife and a bitter former advisor. Got it. Look, you don't believe me, but... No, I don't. Either you're full of crap or you're a hypocrite for helping him. Can we just focus on the mission? Where the mask said to go? Let's double back. We'll find a way around. See? More Hellwalkers! That means we're headed the right way! Come on, Loki, try to keep up! <laughs> 
I got this. Uh huh. Sure you do. Hey, we're okay, right? I guess. Maybe our families are just meant to be enemies. Well, not us. I don't believe that. What I do believe is that you'll make a great Valkyrie. I'll tell your mom the same thing. Even if she scares the life out of me. Now, we have a masterpiece to find. No oyster up here either. Now what? I'm not sure. But my gut's telling me what we need is here. It fell through the floor. Could be our way up. Let's head back down and find out. Now we go right. And this way is blocked too. There has to be another way. Keep your eyes peeled. Let's go. What's the mask say? So, the mask's pull is a little weird with all these buildings in the way, but I think we're going the right way. You think? with me I need this to go well I need my family to see what I can do I know we both do mask uh, looks like it's through here let me get that for you okay this thing is really fighting me See anything in there? There. Nice. Whatever you shot crashed through the floor again. Let's head back and check it out. So, I talk about my mom a lot. What's your dad like? He's intense. Like he's trying to force me into this mold. But I'm not sure that's me. Oof. Well, I know exactly what that's like. 
thing is, I don't know what I want. I love that you do. You'll figure it out. Whoa! Four of them! Okay! That's a big one! I'm keeping me in that start after this. Which way? The mask showed it was straight ahead earlier. But of course the way's blocked. Maybe they're trying to keep people out. Sweet. So, how'd you know you wanted to be a Valkyrie? I didn't always. After a bad fight with Mom, I snuck out and found them training. Somehow, every movement they made had such purpose. Like they knew exactly where they needed to be. And in that moment, so did I. Uh, looks like it's through here. Gave me too heavy. Shut up. Someone's blocking it. I'll take a look, but I want to hear the rest. <laughs> Not bad. I know. As I was saying, seeing the Valkyries fight, oh, strength and style, no apologies. Gave me clarity. For the first time, I saw my path forward clear as day. Too bad giants have to follow prophecy. Who cares? Make your own path, just like we've been doing here. Now let's see. Step aside, little man. Ugh, this one's stuck too! But I feel it weakening. I just need to give it a little more mustard. Looks like it. Bring it on! Jump up! Yeah! 
I think it's through here, but it's blocked. What if I move this? Aha! Can you get up there? See if you can find a way to cut the crate down on the other side. I'll wait here. I don't have a fancy way up like you do. Got it. <clears throat> Ingrid. Was I too rude about her grandfather? She should know the truth, right? Yeah, guess so. Hey, you talking to me? Uh, no. Just talking to Ingrid. Okay. Well, I'm waiting. <laughs> Can I get a better view of that crate? open. Let's go. Whoa. The mask is freaking out. We must be close. <laughs> what was that? Don't look at me. You're the one who's been here before. It's probably nothing. Doesn't sound like nothing. We gotta get out of here. The mask. We're so close. Besides, I don't think it's dangerous. Are we looking at the same thing? Maybe he's locked up for a good reason. I can feel what he's feeling. It's a giant thing. Look, he just wants to be free. The peace must be behind him. Trust me. All right, let's start with the lock not near its teeth. There we go. 
Heavy sleeper. Let's do the next. There was another one under his foot. You're welcome, Mangy Mutt. Let's look in the chamber he was guarding. Down in the water or something? There's... How? It's not responding anymore. This has never happened. But you said trust you. And we let that thing loose. Grandfather's gonna kill me. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Through. Wait up. Maybe we missed it. Maybe it's back here. Through. Through. It's... It's gonna be okay. How can you say that? I shouldn't have listened to you. Look, if I made a mistake, I'll fix it. I can find the piece. You absolute, unqualified moron! You know that thing tears holes between realms, right? Call me a half I will call you whatever I like, Junior. Leave him alone. It was a mistake. No! The mistake was allowing you to think that you were ready. You helped him, didn't you? What side are you on anyway, Guppy? Try me and find out. Oh. <laughs> and what are you going to do exactly? <sighs> you see, everyone takes it easy on you because they are afraid of your father. I am not. That fat, drunken, utter piece of trash! <laughs> Yes, yes, the dumb does not fall far from the tree. Very well, then. Give me your best shot. <laughs> you have a lot to learn, little girl. Starting with who your family is and who it is not. Just wait until I'm a Valkyrie. <laughs> Oh. You really believe the Allfather would allow that to happen? <sighs> Please do not let this little weasel feed your delusions any longer. Enough! So close. Stop! He just wants to make you mad. Yeah? Toddlers are boring. If you are finished throwing your little tantrum, we should go now. Because I cannot wait to watch you explain this mess to the author. Oh, it's going to be glorious. Boogan! He's not here. Let's check his study. Oh, boy, is he going to lose it. Father will have my back. 
After the Allfather sent him away sulking with his tail between his legs? Doubtful. And you, Loki of the Jotnar. I am haunted by your incompetence. It keeps me up at night. Whatever. <laughs> no, I, seriously, I, I find the hues and shades of your shortcomings almost moving. If we could only somehow harness your uselessness, we could fuel this entire city. Fine. It's all on me. Just leave her out of it. I don't need your help, Loki. Sorry. Save it for the Allfather. We have a lot to discuss. Loki, I'll meet you in your room when I'm finished here. Shouldn't be long. Okay. My mission went quite well, Allfather. Thanks a lot. Throod, I... I don't want to hear it. Everything was fine until you showed up. I'll make it up to you, I swear. I don't really want to talk right now. What did you think would happen? She hates me, Thor. My little... You can't keep undermining me like that. Training her behind my back? She's gonna do what she wants. Wouldn't you rather I at least help? Know where she's going, keep her safe. No, I'd rather us be a team. I'd like you to back me up for once. You're ruining what little relationship I have left with her. I'm doing the best I can to keep this family together. If that were true, you'd stand up to your father for once in your life. You're right. Honey. No. You're right. What kind of example am I setting? Seems the only thing I can do right these days is destroy everything around me. We just... We need you here. I need you. I can't do this by myself. I really messed up. Times like this, I really miss home. May I come in? I heard what Heimdall had to say. I'd like to hear it from you. What happened? It wasn't there. I was wrong. Well, we all make mistakes, son. But freeing Garm, <laughs> that was a big one. Chaos is already spilling out into the other realms. We're safe here in Asgard, but everywhere else. I think I want to go home now. Okay, if that's what you want. I meant it when I said you're not a prisoner here. It's your choice. Go, clear your mind. I know you'll be back. But before you go, I'll need the mask back. It's not that I don't trust you, you understand. It's the company you keep. Oh, and Ingrid? Please, I need to go. Loki. When you do decide you're ready to continue our work here, Hugin will be waiting for you in your old home. You screwed up. Doesn't change the fact that you're welcome here.
Oh, and say hi to Mimir for me. Never thought I'd be so relieved to be back here. If you're staying, you might be waiting a while. Better use the Mystic Gateway quick. Odin was right. Bringing the arm. How did I screw up so badly? Okay. Guess it's time to face him. No running away this time. Almost home. It's gonna be fine. Everything's fine. No, no, no! It's you! Wait, it's you! Here! Nice time! Kill something, will ya? Where's father? He's trying to find a way to you! Do you mind? We're being attacked right now! Atreus, watch out! This won't stop until I close that realm tear. Atreus, help keep them off me! No thanks to you. Where is Atreus? 
Freyas. Has the runaway returned and brought all this with him? God, just hold still. I told you I'm fine. Oh, you're bleeding. Quit your blubber. It's all my fault. The Hellwalkers... They're everywhere. Everywhere. That is not your fault. Yes, it is. There was a wolf in hell. He was in chains and... And I set him free. I, I thought that if... Garm! Great bleeding fuck lad, you freed Garm! Garm? Who freed Garm? That's madness. Surely not you, young one. If the Hound of Hell is loose, he'll chew through the fabric of the realms. Hellwalkers are just the beginning. What were you thinking? Aye, this is a fuck-up of not insignificant proportions. What would drive you to such mischief? Is this Loki's doing? Enough. Leave him. Atreus has made a mistake. One that we... Together. Grand. Now, if you don't mind, I'd rather stay here. I've had my fill of visits to Helheim. One problem. Excuse I'm not sure I have a way back to Alon. Perhaps the squirrel does. I need to speak with you at once. At once, I think. Whoa! Gentlemen, I apologize for my brusque tone, but whatever has lately transpired in Helheim is completely unacceptable. I must insist you remedy this. We are going. And do try not to fuck up. Aren't you gonna, you know, reprimand me? No. I am relieved. You are safe. Okay. Wow. Maybe I should run away more often. Atreus. Kidding. Sorry. So where'd the new spear come from? Brock made it. From Dropnir. What's that? A ring. But what's its story? I do not know. You were not there to ask. Arm damage out there? No. That's a relief. I know. I 
towers? Cool. Come on. You gotta get across before he opens up more realm tears. What? No. Why? Are you not working with him? It's not what you think. Whatever he promised, he cannot be trusted. I don't. But he has something I need. It's hard to explain. Get up there. But this ice is in the way. I will handle it. The wind from your wings. Trust me. I know I have no right to ask. Can you anyway? What does he have that you need? Why can you not tell me? It's complicated. What about you? Why do you have a new weapon? I thought you didn't want war. I do not. But... It's complicated? Everyone keeps secrets. Sometimes it's the only way to protect the ones we love. And don't worry about Odin. I'm not going back there. That is good to hear. A realm tear. Arm's been busy. I think I understand how Freya closed them. Keep the enemies away if you can. I can. Let me know when you're ready. <laughs> Bet if we follow those Hellwalkers up there, we find Garm. <laughs> Deep up! 
Thanks for coming back with me. You didn't have to. I am your father. I will always help, as long as I am able. Well, that's good to hear too. Tell me, what were you doing in Asgard? I was translating things for Odin. There's this mask he found and uh... connected to it. It's all sort of... Complicated. Yeah, but I met people my age there. Made friends. I think we're still friends. You cannot trust those loyal to Odin. It's not always bad to trust people. It compromises your judgment. Maybe. I'm tired of feeling alone. Atreus, I... Let's just figure out how this gate works, okay? Here's blocked when the gate is up. Maybe we can use my new arrows. They can chain elements.
doesn't want Ragnarok. I, I know I can't trust him, but I needed his help. I can't let Ragnarok take him either. I would have helped you. I know, but... Wait! He's right here! Okay! Okay! It's okay, boy! It's alright. Just calm! I just wanna... through here. If Odin truly wishes to avoid Ragnarok, then we are in agreement. Yeah? Then what's that spear for? To protect you. Don't you have other weapons for that? <gasps> what are these guys doing uh, here? They are dead. Oh, yeah. Fair point. when they're alive. Oh, <laughs> 
if you're not preparing for Ragnarok. Seriously, I the spear. I share. It's your turn. We are not the same. I am the parent. You're ducking the question. Alka! My arrows will stick to the wood up there. Close. Promise me you won't kill him, okay? I make no promises, but I will try not to kill the beast. Notch in the wall. What is your plan? I'm sort of making it up as I go. But you're not talking about Varm. You cannot outsmart Odin. It's worked so far. Has it? Now what? I'm gonna try to tame it. Tame it? Sure. I've tamed wolves before. You freeze his chains with your axe so we can't run and latch him onto something. No, too dangerous. It's a good plan. Let's move. Wait.
Are you okay? Are you almost... Your transformation. Did Odin teach you to control it? No. We will not rely on what he taught you. Next time, we do it my way. Yes, sir. Why didn't that work? You didn't mess up on purpose, did you? Now who does not trust? Sorry. I just... I thought it would work. Patience. We'll find a way. My arrows will slow her down! I think I hear him up ahead. We do this my way now. Yes, your way means... It means what you think it means. Can't we try and... We have the power to limit the harm this creature can cause. We will use it. Okay. <laughs>
getting ready to attack! <laughs> I wish it didn't have to end that way. It's my fault he got loose. That he's dead. Sometimes there is no other way. Just go home now. Atreus. I know. Close my heart to it. <sighs> Another locked door. Come on, the gate's open. Let's go before it unfixes. Oh, on. I sought the Norns. They told me Heimdall intended to kill you in Asgard. Heimdall? The Norns? I thought you didn't believe in that.
Find him. The dead will keep flooding the realms. The realms will collapse. You must learn to calm your mind. Maybe I've learned I run better on chaos. What else did you learn? We work better when we trust each other. <laughs> Hear that? Where is he? <laughs> Gotta find him. Come on. Well, guess he came this way. Let's find another way up. What did you do? At the house. The spell you saw me do in Fenrir died. I didn't know it then. 
but I accidentally put his soul into my knife. Souls are powerful, so I thought maybe Fenrir's could... Change its nature. Yeah, let's see if it took. When I found you in Midgard, before Freya attacked, you said you needed to protect me. Why? I saw prophecy. You were... in my arms. Dead. I saw it too. In Jotunheim. What? You knew? That's why you've been training me so hard. One day, you will have to survive without me. Not gonna happen. I won't let it. I won't. All journeys come to an end. Not ours. Huh? Not like that. you too. Didn't know if that would work. We did it. Sit. How is this possible? It's giant magic. I've been learning things. In Asgard. This has nothing to do with that. More secrets. No. A promise. Something that someone's trusting me to keep. Like you kept your promise to mom? Hmm. See what I can do when you trust me? Hmm. Oh. So, when the Nords told you Heimdall was going to try and kill me, that's what your spear's for, isn't it? It is. Heimdall's a jerk, but that's not who you are anymore, right? A god killer? You don't want war. No, but I will do what it takes to keep you safe. I guess it's so boss. Great, it's open. Maybe we can use the sigils to freeze the gear up there. Father, if you can't trust the faith, why do you care what they say? When it comes to your life, I can take no chances. Look here. Gateway got buried. I have it. What 
us on. Without you, I got reckless, overconfident, made stupid mistakes. I don't know why I thought I could do this alone. You were right. No. On our journey together. You have grown into a warrior, worthy of your namesake. I was the one who was not ready. You don't have to be who you were just because I'm not there. Let's make a promise. I'll listen for your voice in my head when you're not there to guide me. And you do the same. All right? I need to know you'll be okay without me. Don't be sorry, Father. Be better. Let's go home. Shouldn't let prophecy define our choices. Then we will make our own destiny. Did you want to take care of anything before going back to Sindri's? No. First, we retrieve Mamir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were aligned. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh. Before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Hey, she didn't kill me. I said nothing. He's off cleaning up all the damage God did. We'll try back soon, yeah? <laughs> sure. You're back. How did it go? The beast should trouble us no further. Well, that's a bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus. 
Your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on, let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Namir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Was it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone, I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sandry? I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. While we're clearing the air, I hope that I can be forgiven for not doing more when the Hellwalkers attacked. Whatever reservations I have about violence, they shouldn't apply when your home is under attack. And certainly not by undead abominations. Yet I reached for a shield instead of a sword. You were right to chide me for that, old friend. The next time the moment calls me, I'll be ready. Well said, Tyr. I believe you just might. Dug up some new blueprints for you. <laughs> Appreciate it. Hey, wait! We're with you. Checking on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. So what happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. 
You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. But he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Wow. It's beautiful. And, uh, what? It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? What's this thing? Some kind of altar? I do not know. Freya's camp is to the right. No rush, is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. To Freya's camp, then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her, though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. And there is much I owe her. The other half of the broken Muspelheim seed we found. We can take it to a Mystic Gateway. Maybe we'll find Sutter's combat trials. <laughs> 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 Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildis Vini! Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh... I am so... so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor. And... Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Where's Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Bigvir. They've been captured by the Einherjar. 
Hey, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skull and Hati, it'd be a fellow giant. Well, if you don't disappoint, continue down this path and you'll find their den. Good luck. And don't shoot any boars. <laughs> Do you think he's really forgiven me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. But so is privacy, huh? Okay, okay. Point taken. and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Spartal Farm, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Egros. I like it. Going for more loot, huh? I saw a forge back at Freyr's camp. Has Brock been helping them out this whole time? Ah, you haven't met Lunda yet. Who's Lunda? An old contemporary of the Hulda brothers. She serves as Freyr's blacksmith, keeping his team armed and outfitted. Oh. Huh?
Another legendary blacksmith? I bet she has some good stories. Take caution, Atreus. What? Why? She is quite... friendly. <laughs> oh, nonsense. The lad's far too young for her taste. Uh, <laughs> what? You know, lad, this excursion into Vanai means you've now visited each of the Nine Realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. So does being that both Frey and Bigbeer were captured? <laughs> Bigbeer is the light elf who wanted to learn more about that library in Alfheim, right? Correct. An exiled scholar married to a warrior, Bela. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. No. That raises even more questions. He's okay. Hey, there you are, barricades. Aye, not a good sign. They've pushed farther into the jungle since our last visit. told us Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. <laughs> Which after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. That's gotta be why the Einar stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah. <laughs> that, I guess.
I can sense them up there. It's got to be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hattie, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. The Aenor Yard played a part according to Skull and Hati's shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? Bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try that first. So besides Hildefini and the elves, who else is part <laughs> player on the Not much army, really. Although Beergirl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice. <laughs> believe no one's here. They hide. Vanier aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. go wait this is definitely an ambush yes we can get to it from up here look out called it Father, shield strike Let's <laughs> 
Hoping that puts a dent in Odin's forces for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. Hey! Hurry! She's getting away! Come on! A double ambush? Okay. She's gone again. Hurry, we gotta get across. Times the charm. They are not smart. I and does that. You know, what we're doing right now, all of this, it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? Everything we're doing now happened in the Yoda. Whoa! What is that? A wyvern! Nasty beast! Just a lie! From Helheim. Heimdall must have grabbed this while I freed Garm. Ugh. I was there, but 
I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the Giants said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. But what if, by doing all this, what if we're walking straight into Ragnarok? Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from... Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. There's nothing. the shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Call them anytime we need them. Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. Perhaps Freya will know. So, in essence, they just gave us the keys of dust till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hilda's Feeney and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. Look out! Oh! <laughs> 
Yep. Still very, very eager. Making it last now. Come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anhuriyar we've been fighting, we've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. like the egros. We can get across from up here. report back to Hildes Fini, then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, father. Plants here want to kill us? No, no. Only the carnaptious ones. Wrinkly mud belongs to Helka. She's a blossomer, hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Kratos, Atreus, that eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. 
Bela's already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. The fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. Once you see the signal, count it down. Come, Kratos. We should get moving. I can stoke the fires of those shade blades for you. Thanks for grabbing that for us. Oh, hi. Don't change the ding dang time of day. Okay, well, that's impressive. Bruh, when you knew Faye, was she. Let me stop you right there, killer. Brock ain't one to go breaking no confidences. Not even when it comes to the dearly departed. You don't hear me spreading your business all over town, do you? Smiths don't blab. It's just how it's gotta be. The wolves gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einher Yar are holding fear in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Big Fear, the altars were once used to signal the wolves. And now we have just the scepter to do it. What is your plan? When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Bela and Birger to set off their distraction. The Dark Elf Hive. Nice to not be on the receiving end of it for once. With their attention drawn elsewhere, you and I can assault the main force from behind. While Atreus and Hildesvini slip in to rescue your brother in the confusion. Yes. Once we see their beacon, we'll regroup by the river and escape on Freya's boat. The witch <laughs> Finally! Oh, oh, you 
Careful, brother. I am covered in blind rod. They've rallied more soldiers since our last visit. Hmm. Our disadvantages are many. <laughs> Try dragging the scepter across the bell a few times. Come on, we're making good time. Our actions in this realm follow the prophecy of the giants. Atreus believes Ragnarok is inevitable. The Norns were quite clear on the nature of prophecy. They told us the sum of our choices were predictable. But we have changed. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, brother! You're covered in my rod! The Norn said you'd kill Heimdall, but you chose not to walk that path. Back when we first met, I doubt you'd have done the same. And you? Do you still seek Ragnarok? Odin has much to answer for. If Groa's prophecy is correct, perhaps my realm can finally know peace. Perhaps I can know peace. Forgive me for being a head on a belt, but haven't we all just established how prophecy is pure havers? Gods, Namir. What? The most annoying man alive. More up ahead. Oh, what? Oh, what? 
It was in our way. Aye, I don't doubt it. Curious, though. What was she doing here? Odin used roots of the World Tree as part of his spell that kept me from leaving Midgard. Neathog protects the tree's roots, wherever they are. Ah, I see. Odin used her. And she unwittingly paid the price. Classic Odin. Extra noise once the assault begins. If we distract them long enough, Hildespini and Atreus will have more than enough time to get in and out undetected. I am not worried for Atreus. He is ready to fight on his own. This is it. There's an altar behind these vines. <laughs> Call on Skull, please. Are you ready? I am. Are you? I'm not leaving here without my brother. <clears throat> We're coming for you, Ingvi. Position. 
<laughs> what idiots! Oh. If it isn't Queen Mistletoe herself. Hilarious, by the way. Been a while. I'm dull. <laughs> and you must be the little half-breed's father. Lucky day! <laughs> You have a lot to answer for, Sunshine. You too, traitor. Better a traitor than Odin's lapdog. Hmm. <laughs> burden is mine. I can help. I know. But you are needed elsewhere. He's right, you know. Sizzles wasn't looking so hot last I saw. I know you didn't want this, but we know how this ends. See you soon. Well, we both know that's not true. <laughs> but don't worry, Frigg. I'll be coming for you and your brother as soon as I am finished here. Now, what you got? Really? You are the one who killed... Alder? Whoa! What did Cool Toll Forever do to you? Write it down, Cool Toper! Disappointed! Have some vibro! On me! Oh, so aggressive! So angry! <laughs> Having fun yet? Oh well, you and me then! How quaint! No match for Bifrost! Come on! Hug me! Oh look! The stick is back! Oh wait! You expected the stick to give you an advantage? Yawn! Hilarious! The scion of the Aesir brought down by an old geezer's cage! Ha! You are rudely prolonging all this. Well, I'm waiting. No. Any day now. No! No! My good God! You are sick! What? I can feel your frustration. It is immensely satisfying. What now, brother? Oh. This pair remains our best chance. Oh. Let's go already. Any day now. These are new braces. <laughs> ah, I can see the resemblance now. Funny? <laughs> Hard to tell. Ah, you actually hit me! Slow down! Oh, I 
don't remember the last time anyone hit me. Slow down. Come on, brother. You hit him once. Just gotta find the right opening. Remember! Hey, don't fight! Slow it down. Oh, he is mad now, isn't he? <laughs> there we are! Armor fit for a cup. Right, brother! You think you can bring down the Asgard? No! You strike like a sloppy cow! What? That's all this is! What is going on in that empty head? Oh, no, 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 no. You are going to spare me out of pity! <laughs> Let it go, you may live. Is this about the little runt? Oh, now I am definitely going to gut him! <laughs> <laughs> This is your final warning. I don't think a warning is going to cut it. You think you get to just walk away? No. That is not how this works. <laughs> <laughs> Get to decide my fate! You are dead, sunshine. You are in way over your head! Don't you know who I am? I am the Watchman of the Aesir, the Herald of Ragnarok! I am going to find that little mockerel of yours and beat his lips into a pulp! Only one of us is walking away from this. And it's sure as shit will not be you. You are mine. How dare you try and spare me? I am growing very sick of
Kratos, that was just... Uh, I don't know if we are breaking fate, or fate's breaking us. At least the rescue's going well. Hey, I'm a trade. You okay? Bye. 
No! Just hold on! <laughs> Relax. It's flying. We're flying. I knew it would do that. Think that's the end of Birger? You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. We'll see. He. Uh, 
He has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. and boiling water. Red root and lamb's grass. I know, I know. You think I never staunch a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda. Easy. Heck you says to me for? I'm the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely? Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vanaheim's in good hands. Body at Sindri's house, huh? Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Go on. Take it. Sail the skies. Sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. Gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. Because it was necessary. Not because it was written. Galahort is the Herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Odin's library. Supposedly it... Hold it, Treus. We will discuss in private. Hey, hot stuff. Remember. I need that <laughs> over. Would have been a shame to have left that behind. Heimdall is dead. Good. Is it? Look, I don't know from fate. But I know Heimdall was a prize-winning taint stain with the capital stank. If he was gonna hurt your boy, it's a good thing he ain't around no more. The Norns didn't quite see it that way. The opinion of them three shut-in spinsters ain't worth a goat fart in a hurricane. You did what you did. No need to fret about it. Hope you and your loin sprout ain't got any holes where you don't want them. We are fine. Oh, honey, you don't have to worry about him. Gave him a once over just as soon as Freyr was patched up and on his way. Did you now? <clears throat> you gonna lurk all day or are we gonna do something? I'm sorry, Dad. Vera was the one who found me wounded in the jungle when I was trying to find my way back here. Watched over me as I slept. I never thanked him. What does that mean? Helka smells something. Could be important. Maybe we should follow her. Good to see you again, Kratos. Have you been back to Alpine? To find <laughs> All right. Tracks. Yep. Helka's. Where are you leading us, girl? So, what do you want to do now? We don't have to go straight home, do we? Ah, we can always try finding Helka some other time. I wanted to tell you. 
I read something in Odin's library about what Gjallarhorn is supposed to do. If blown by a god, it sounds through all the realms, and harmonizes the space between them. Blow it somewhere like Tyr's temple, and it would be like opening up all the realm travel towers at once. It's quite a vulnerability. Wonder why he didn't just destroy it. Some artifacts oh. defy destruction. Well, we should make Freya aware of this. You're here! Thank goodness! Here's what I found. This one has a strong personality. Good thing Speak. I've got it. The tree has become rather... overgrown. And? And, if it grows too wildly, the branches risk getting too heavy and falling, which is not ideal considering they hold all the rounds. I am no gardener. What an absolute shock. No, I do not require any horticultural skills from you, but I would ask that you keep an eye open for the stags of the Four Seasons. They normally graze upon the tree and keep it tidy. Unfortunately, Bitter decided it would be funny to trick Arrogant into releasing them. If you happen to find the stags during your travels, I would greatly appreciate assistance in bringing them home. I would have one of my spectral squirrels do it, but they, well, keep eating the feed I give them. Consequence of it being the most delicious food in all the Nine Realms, I suppose. Speaking of, here, take some feed. Once you've found a stag, the feed should calm them down. Then one of my spectrals will guide them back here. And, uh, don't eat the feed, please. I will not. Bitterness asked me if I was too chicken to release them. But I am, in fact, not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I have no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? We now, are off. Any luck finding those leaves? Are the best. You have always been the best. Hey, tell her she's the best. Oh! You're back. The heroes of the hour. I want to hear everything. I mean... Enough. Look at that. <laughs> you really did it. How, in all the nine realms, did you manage to kill Heimdall? I knew our spear would do the trick. Well, happy Ragnarok, everybody. Let's drink. Is it true? Heimdall's dead. I can't believe it. There's no stopping it now. Odin swore peace only so long as you spilled no more Aesir blood. I refused that deal. Yet he honored it. But now... But what? You and I know better than anyone that Odin's promises never last. We have the advantage now. It's time to bring him down. No. None of you understand what's coming. Odin's vengeance will be his only concern. Not his only concern. The mask. Whatever knowledge it unlocks, that's what Odin wants more than anything. If I go back to Asgard, go I back. can... Go back. Go back. Look. If I can finish what I started there, awaken the mask, get answers, maybe that's our way out of this. But I gotta go soon. Before they figure out what's happened. Joyce, you are home. Do not ask me to put you at risk again. He's at risk where he stands, Kratos. We all are. Anything we do or don't do is dangerous right now. But Odin needs me. He trusts me. I'll be safe there. From a tactical perspective, am I wrong? I don't much like it, but it is our best play. Dividing Odin's focus would buy us time. And give us a pair of eyes in the enemy's inner sanctum. But if there is truly a source of infinite knowledge, you can't.
can't let Odin have it. Aye. And once he has what he needs from you... Then I lose my leverage. I get it. I'll be smart. Father. I can do this. Remember our promise. You too. I hope you know what you're doing. I do too, Sam. Well, I still want to hear how you did it. You mean how we did it? I uh, yeah, have it. And therein lies a tale. Trace, listen. I can't let you go back without this. A hammer? Your key, please. You ever need a way out of a bad situation? Throw this down hard and say Wergi. One use only. Wergi. Thanks, Sindri. Hope I don't need it. Me too. All right. Odin said Hugin would be waiting in the cabin. Mimir, anything else I should know about Odin? Maybe a uh, weakness or something? Like if I flip up his eye patch, he'll disintegrate. Aye, lad. Well, not be. Yeah, no. Sorry, Mimir. I can't do your accent. I'm on my own for this one. <sighs> Here we go. You were having a moment. I can go. No, sorry. This is Fenrir. <laughs> it's okay, Ben. She's uh. <laughs> so I was right about your knife. Huh? I'm glad you found a place for a soul. <laughs> me too. Hey, uh, how'd you find me here? Loki? This is my marble. And where are you heading off to? Back to Asgard. Hey, I'm actually using him. Uh-huh. Ingraboda, look. Once I see this through, I'm gonna know everything. How to save my father, how to stop Ragnarok, and maybe, hopefully, how to bring our people back. Loki, those are all very noble intentions. But he's Odin. You have faith in me, right? Of course I do. I just hope the story you're writing for yourself is the one that you truly want. Would you, would you take care of Finn while I'm away? I'll take good care of him. Good night, boy. <laughs> Be careful, Loki. Oh, 
Okay. Just gotta help Odin complete the mask. But also make sure he doesn't get any answers from it. Easy, right? He's probably in a study. Defend themselves doesn't mean they're hey, guilty. Hey, uh, sorry for interrupting. Uh, you're not interrupting anything. Forsetti's investigating, so the truth will come out soon enough. I hope it does. You'd better go. Okay. Panic does nothing. Harness it. Heimdall's dead. Happen to know something about that? Anything? Well, I mean, everyone hated him. Sure, sure. But have you seen anything? Something noteworthy? I mean... You know, he did sock through pretty hard while we were out. Maybe someone found out? Got even? I... I don't know. Are you suggesting my son had something to do with this? I don't know. Honest. Well, I have to ask. Never believed you had anything to do with this. I'm glad you're back. So, I figured out what went wrong. I mistranslated a word here. Did you now? I thought it said beyond the cry of cold breath, but it actually reads the cry of first breath. Well, that's somewhere else entirely. I know where that is. Young man, you've done it again. Go. Take the mask, take the sword, take the bird. Find Thor. With only this D2. Hey, Ingrid, you wouldn't happen to know where Thor is. Yeah, I figured. Sorry, um, all father said I'm supposed to head to Niflheim with your dad. I haven't seen him around, and I was wondering if you had any idea where he could be. He wasn't with grandfather? No. I think I know where he might be. Follow me. I, uh, also wanted to talk to you about Heimdall. Don't. Not here. You're right. Later. Back in Helheim, I told you I'd help your mom understand how much becoming a Valkyrie meant to you. I wanted to, uh, let you know that I meant it. You didn't. And you're still alive? I haven't yet, but I will, as soon as I come back. <laughs> There'll be plenty of time to get under her skin later. Thanks, Loki. Weapons aren't allowed inside. We'll have to check them. Why? Just do it. Come on. This way. Oh. Huh. Come on. 
They're not gonna let you in otherwise. Look around. He'll be here. <laughs> It's fine. Hey, Thor. Seems like it might be a bad time, so... If you need a moment, I totally understand. No rush, but... Uh... Right where I thought you'd be. What are you doing here? You shouldn't be here. shouldn't have brought her here. What are you doing? Relaxing. Did I say no rush? I meant we should get going, right? We don't want to keep the Allfather... Quiet! He's right. You should get going. <laughs> Don't do this. It's already done. Let it be known, the God of Thunder is good for two things. Killing giants and pissing me! <laughs> Any man who disagrees will greet Mjolnir with his face. This isn't you. Thor. <clears throat> Yugen is waiting outside. Please, let's just... I said, quiet, boy. My name is... What? No, I... Oh, come on. No, 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 I swear that really wasn't... <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 
still conscious! his arms. Let's get him out of here. It's a good fight. I'm sorry you had to see him like this. No. No. It's fine. Really. Hey, I'm strong, but you gotta help me out here. It's not that far. Get up. Ah, Sarudi. You are going to Niflheim with Loki. All father's orders. You have to get up. I know you're disappointed. Disappointed? No, 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 no. That was a glorious fight. You can't even say you're sorry this time, can you? Because what's one more broken promise? <sighs> Grandfather treated you like crap. You were struggling. I get it. But you can't just... We're here for you. Mom and I are here for you. Even when you're here. We love you. You know that. I just thought this was behind us. I fucked. Or something. Let's make this quick. I'm ready to get back to Asgard. Just get us to that mask piece. <laughs> Thank you. 
Was it worth it? No, 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 no. Fine, but I hope you know what's being like that hit you. I was drunk, not blind. Why can't we just fly over these guys straight to the mat? You think I want to carry you all that way? You're strong! I'm not your pack horse. <laughs> Don't bother me. looks up to you. I hope you know that. Don't need a lecture about parenting from you. Just find the thing. Looks like we gotta head through that wall. You Something wanna... I need to do first. Thank you, Tom. Have giant son of a powerful god with impossibly high expectations. How could I ever know what I'm not trying to do anything. I'm just pointing out we're not that different. I got no interest in bonding over shared blood. Another wall of ice. Hmm. Thor, mm -hmm. could you... Okay. I just want to add one more thing. If you can't be yourself, you also might not feel like you can follow your own path. That doesn't sound familiar to you at all?
So we've got some similar life experience. What does it matter? Seems stupid to gripe about the things we can't change. Who says we can't? <laughs> from Ivaldi's workshop, right? Far enough. Damn it! Ancient! Again with the griping. Calling out a problem isn't griping. It's healthy! <laughs> Bet you're glad I'm helping so much this time around. You're welcome. I will say the sword's doing work over there. You're lucky she's helping, too. Just ahead. This will be fun. I don't think that's where we're supposed to go. So? I said it'd be fun. It was. Up this way. Looks like there's a path. One pathway coming up. You enjoying the freedom? Out here without Fabio looking over your shoulder. I, uh, well, yeah, I guess. It's different from what I'm used to. In a good way. Looks like we gotta get up that cliff. Try to see. No thinking. It's better when I know it's gonna happen. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Jump up! Thor, I, um, hope everything goes okay when you see Sif and Thud again. Well, hopefully he's better than you think. It's a start. Close. Um, thanks, Thor. Wasn't about to lose that. Loki, we did it. We are on the verge of great things, all of our work together. You're welcome. I'm sorry. You are here. Why? His father murdered Heimdall. For said he has proof. Take him. No. Leave him alone. I command it. You said no more Aesir blood would be spilled. You said family comes first. You don't think that this is retribution for him being here? He's put your granddaughter in danger. He's made your son miserable. Loki didn't kill Heimdall. His father did. Your daughter is old enough to make her own mistakes. And your husband started drinking again all on his own. Dismissed! You two, a word. Can't you see what's happening? He's not protecting us. Magni, Modi, our boys. We used to tell them stories by the fire. Do you remember? We would carve those wooden horses. We would play and laugh until the sun sank and they fell asleep in our laps. They were thrown at the All-Father's problems like brittle knives to a mountain face. And for what? What if Thrut's next? Thought of something I can teach you. Hey, you down down. We better be right. Where is Sindri? Ugh. You sure know how to plan an exit. Atreus. <sighs> Glad you're safe, lad. Got out just in time. Pretty sure I burned my bridges in Asgard, though. Wait, why were you out here? Sindri told us where you would arrive should you find trouble. Oh, thought you might have been exploring without me. No, lad. Your dad was just concerned. Though, now that you mention it... Mimir. Brother, please. It's all so crowded and tense back home. Don't you miss the three of us out finding our own adventures? Putting off the inevitable. Exactly! It's not the worst idea. I do want to show everyone the mask, but it'll keep. Hmm. Hey! 
back, everybody. Hey, you made it. I'll get to here. Do you want to set the table if you're ready to stay? Oh, see? I told you the key would get him home. Because you tapped it with a hammer. Dwarven magic makes no sense. Right? Luna one time made me a breastplate out of dog barks. You're I back. I still can't figure that one out. Are you okay? I'm fine. I just hope unlocking this thing was worth the cost. You have it. What did it show you? I didn't get to use it. They found out about Heimdall. I had to run. But at least Odin can't use it either. But if you didn't get any answers from the mask, all you've done is steal Odin's greatest treasure. Just after your father's killed his most loyal ally. None of us are safe. Even here. So we have no choice. We find Surtur, sound Galahorn, and bring Odin to justice. Now. You'd incinerate every soul in Asgard and call it self-defense? Does he ever suggest plans or just crap on everyone else's? The obvious plan is staring you in the face. We don't need Odin to use this. We can slip into Asgard and do it ourselves, right under his nose. We gain the knowledge we need to shatter this prophecy of war once and for all. Except begging your pardon, you don't have a way into Asgard. They got the big horn, don't they? Oh, so you expect them to sneak into Asgard, blowing a horn that sounds across all the realms? I expect you to bite my blue butt cheek. Please, just think about it. This mask. The easy answers that it promises. I know this. Shortcuts always have a price. Atreus, you have carried it. What do you think? I think it's a chance. At worst, we'll have something Odin wants as leverage. At best, if it really gives us all the answers, then we can make our own path. Nobody has to die. Grand. Now all we need is a way to Asgard. I know I've been a burden to you all. I know you've questioned why you even pulled me out of that hole. I have too. But it's clear now. This is what I'm needed for. This is my purpose. One last time, I will pick up my spear and I will lead us to Asgard. Excuse me, but if you got a way to Asgard, where's that idea been this whole fucking while? Lax! Not that a fair question, brother. You was held Asgard. You would have gotten us all killed. And we needed to give Loki time to find his destiny. Here it is. It's all led to this. If we can get inside, I'm going after Odin. I will not stop you. We can do both. Spot on, brother. If the mask doesn't give us an out, we'll still have the drop on him. Works for me. Let's do it then, and quickly, before he sees us coming. He does hate surprises. Slow down, you damn spruce. I still want to hear the details on this uh, new way to Asgard you got. Spill it! It's an ancient path. We can't reach it from here. Where then? Let me collect my things and I'll show you. You ain't got no things. And where are you going with that massive rock? That belongs to the kid. He earned it. All you done was make passable dirt soup. Brock, it's okay. No, it ain't. This ain't right. All the pieces ain't welding together true. Like, what's with him calling you Loki anyway? You know that ain't his name. Hey! I'm talking to you! You'll never shut up! For the face, Odin. Let go of the boy and face me! I tell your brother to throw me the mask and you've got a deal. Stop moving. Freya, if he dies... No, no. It wasn't part of the plan. But if he dies, we are square for Heimdall. And honestly, you got a bargain. I will kill you. Plan on that. Mm -hmm. So nice spending time with you again. Freya, 
Please. Uh, uh, uh. Can't be in two places at once. Trig. Hey! I don't move, you don't move. Don't do anything you won't crack. I regret many things. Killing you will not be one of them. Son. I am in control! Here! Throw me the mask! Now! David, you have to. You can't. You can't. Maybe if I go back to the lake. Stop it. I know what you've done. And I forgive you. But you gotta stop. This whole time. So, uh, what do we do now? Now? Now we kill Odin and anyone who gets in our way. You can't run away from this, Kratos. Odin won't stop until we stop him! We need you here! Father, where are we going? Father, can we? I... I want to go hunting. I will follow. We are with you, Atreus. Where we headed, lad? In the direction of deer.
wish to speak of what happened? I think I heard something. This way. He just needs space. Here. Tracks. <laughs> They're leading that way. Violence changes us. You are not weak to feel its effects. We're all feeling its effects. We're heading the right way. There's broken branches over there. Come on. I keep seeing it. The knife, Brock, Sentry's face. Son. There it is. Over speed. Why? And that was running. And so are we. I don't understand. Stop the bleeding, or it will die. We have been wounded in this. This is a distraction. It's my fault. No. Find Sindri. I have a pretty good idea where he might be. Lead. Is it okay if we take the sleds? I need to think about what I'm going to say to him. Of course. <clears throat> Everywhere I look, I'm reminded of my mistakes. Our actions have consequences. To be reminded of them is not punishment. Feels like it. If I had just... Seen through a deception that fooled us all. Stopped an attack you could not predict. There is no if, Atreus. Your father's right. There are things even gods cannot control. It's Mona. It's Becky. We can take the sled when you're ready.
Here's Temple. That's where we're headed. Mimir, is there a chance that we could bring Brock back? Sindri did it once. Maybe we could figure out a way to do it again. I'm afraid not, little brother. When a soul missing its full gear, its direction, like rocks, leaves its corporeal form. Well, it can't reach the Lake of Souls. He's not only dead, he's been denied an afterlife. Does nothing to bring back. It's really gone. Atreus, if there was anything we could do, I promise you, we'd be doing it. I know. It was stupid of me to help in the first place. I miss when the lake was still water. I feel like I want to get on a boat and just sail away from you. From everything. You cannot sail away from your mistakes. It is impossible to forget them. I have tried. Aye. They'll follow you no matter where you go, little brother. If you want to sail, do it toward somewhere. The lift at the end of the bridge should still work. We can get up to the temple that way. <sighs> we should just keep moving. Yes. What makes you so sure Sindri will be here? It's where he and Brock reunited. Reforging something that broke. He'll be here. Sindri, I... I am so sorry. No. No, I don't want to hear it. You don't know what sorry means. We're not letting Odin get away with this. Would that be the Odin you invited into my home? We were all fooled. Oh. But some of us were bigger fools than others, aren't we? I gave you everything. My skills. My friendship. My home. My secrets. My treasures. And you just kept taking. And now what have I got? Not even my family. If you want sorry, this is what sorry looks like. I... What can we do? We... There is no we. There's only you. No matter what the cost. So what you can do... Is get the fuck out of my sight! I... I thought we were... 
were his family too. We were. I know I'll feel better when we brought Odin to justice. Justice? Justice is not what we seek. It is vengeance. Every path I walk leads back to vengeance. Maybe that's all we have left. We must return to Freya. <gasps> when we get back, we're... We really are going to war. Win minds, not wars. Tyr understood the greatest fight of them all was the battle for people's hearts and minds. And we were back in Svartalfheim, looking for Tyr. This isn't what I wanted. This wasn't what I meant. Not if it meant losing Brock. We know Atreus. We know. We really took everything from Sindri. Don't take to heart what I'm said ah! in the No matter how spot on they feel. Freya will still be at the house. Don't see why not. Odin's back door in was also his way out. Without the blasted raven apparently hiding in the broom closet, the house should be secure. And she will not turn away allies in her vengeance. Aye, it's all our vengeance now. And no more fake Tear to twist our minds around. Oh, what a mockery he made of Tear's desire for peace and mine. back. Are you with us? Good. It's time. Time for what, dare I ask? Time to unite the realms against Odin once and for all. Tyr tried to unite the realms. The real Tyr. Everyone loved him. And even he failed. Then we better not fail. Or there will be no one left to try. This is Ragnarok. And Odin's already heard every blasted plan we have. Yes, we've lost the element of surprise. More than that, we have only one way to Asgard, and it's not so. Yo. It means we enter from Tyr's temple, here. Asgard's wall is here. Odin's host of Einherjar will hold the space in between. Which means... We need armies of our own. As many as will answer the call. Numbers Odin won't see coming. And that's just to reach the wall. To breach the wall, we'll need to find Surtur. Radatoskar was able to procure this. The three of us will go. I know just where to look. Splendid. Allies, then. Who do we think we can get? I'll venture to Helheim. Try to recruit the army of the dead. And I'll return to Alfheim to unite the elves. Just like that. Unite the elves after centuries of war. Well, they really like me in all fun. And you? To Valheim? Yes. To find Sigrun and muster the free Valkyries. Midgard has no army. Nor Niflheim, nor Jotunheim. That leaves only Svartalfheim. I'll go to Svartalfheim. Sindri? Are you sure? I said I'll go. So be it. Good luck to us all.
Off to Muspelheim to find the last fire giant. I almost envy everyone else's impossible mission. Said you know where to look for Surda. Yeah. I unlocked the secrets in his shrine when I was in Muspelheim with Thor. Thor? Don't worry. He didn't see me go in. That was not my worry. Now look. When we find Surda, we'll have to convince him to combine with his wife, Sinmara. Combine? Yeah. When the two of them, uh, join, they'll create an enormous Asgard-destroying monster. Oh my. <gasps> Apologies. I have some doubts regarding negotiations with Rosfelger and Helheim. My thinking is that she may be more amenable to speaking with a member of the, uh, deceased. Mimir, you're needed. Oh, death is a skill now. I suppose these two can survive a bit without me. Brother, if you wouldn't mind. Very well. Many thanks. We'll catch up with you later. Hey, I think I can see Surtur's forge in the distance. Surtur's wife. Where is she? Nifelheim. I think. Alka! We head down towards that tower. We might be able to see the forge. themselves in their home realms to fight it. Understandable. Probably they'll understand why Ragnarok needs to happen. <laughs> Look, over there. Here before, I got a pretty good feel for the layout. Ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? 
prophecy says he and Sinmara join. But who knows how they're gonna feel about it now. You would try to force these primordial beings into submission. Well, I don't know. We can't win this war without them, right? You gotta be close. I can hear the force. the broken gate. I think we're close. That's gotta be him. We will ask. <laughs> Hello? Serger? <laughs> well, either it isn't him, or he's ignoring us. Come on. Seek a fire giant. 
Go away. What just happened? Hey, that wasn't- We deal with these five. Another one? Focus! He is the guardian of his realm. It is his right to defend it. Got a lot to answer for. As you said, we need him. I won't help you. Who are you? Who you seek? And what's left of him? Why won't you help us? I don't want to elaborate we'll die right because you've got so much to live for not me her so what's the point of all this you keep separate from Sinmara just so you can sit here and wait to die at least if you joined with her You'd be together again. We are together. Got her heart. She's got mine. It's not much. But it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. succeed and all realms save Asgard will fall yeah he must die it's true but I won't sacrifice her any more than you would him sorry come wait those blades. May I see them? Hmm. Yeah, there's primordial fire in those. They are not of these lands. It shouldn't matter. says you two have to combine sure this will work what have I got to live for not here follow me
Where do we go? Spark of the world. Which is? The place where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet. Where the first realms came into existence. You won't be able to get through this. Uh, Surtur? Still me. Better than walking. What awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic. Primordial stuff. With that and your blades and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get you. Big. Smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Don't know. Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or, um, future new you, know when to attack Asgard? You got the horn. Right? Yeah. Then we're good. Soder, were you <clears throat> at the beginning of everything? Yeah. What was it like? <sighs> well. So here it is. The spark of the world. This is beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Gallo on. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that too. This is it. What about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It had hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes... Loving someone is about... Choosing... The lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. I promise... You'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, stabbing you with the blade is going to be enough to create this new you? Sinmar's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those blades. If enough of me and the spark's fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here. Ha <laughs> ha! 
long do you think this is gonna take? way back from there. It worked. I can't believe it. We got Ragnarok on our side. 
Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got all this worry now. He knows we're coming for him. Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win! Frollo's right. Groa failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. The earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make a ledge. Ah! Ah! More of Odin's forces. Trying to finish the job is about to restart it. So, you fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. Place is gonna fall apart if those keep happening. <laughs> Stop attacking anytime soon. We need to get back. <laughs> Your 
quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. Yeah, we have to destroy his shield! Oh. Be prosperity! Oh. 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 Help oh. us! Oh. Be prosperity! Oh. Oh. Ragnarok is here. They know what that means for Asgard. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. Baba, how did it go? And yes, my usefulness to a certain Vanya Nupti did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. We have to now, brother. We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish? This is it then. The beginning of the end. The end for Odin. And after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite. They have to. After everything they've been through. They have to. Don't they? Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know, while we still can? Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack, so there's time. So, 
Sounds like things went well enough in Muspelheim. I mean, probably. Surtur didn't want Samara involved. So instead of them combining to form the Ragnarok team, we did a workaround that left her out of it. Well, hopefully he still shows up at Ragnarok to plunge his sword into the heart of Asgard. And where is that exactly? Only Sutter knows. Okay. Ready when you are. Well, the armies are probably gathered in their home realms. Waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen. The Shield Maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Amir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more, except perhaps a dance, yet though I may have lost a step. Do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I can never argue with you.
Can I sleep here tonight? story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Of course. Now, close your eyes. wood for his village. Every evening he bore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy and he grew weaker as time went. And one day he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Does my request upset you? natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. Mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me.
You are quiet. I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. The funeral fire. I would have chosen different. Oh? You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. Mm. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not on purpose. <laughs> you prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future. That will exist without me whenever that day comes for you and for our son <sighs> we will always walk together Kratos you will always be a part of me I will always be a part of you when you are gone, that part of me dies as well. See, you feel your absence. <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. is to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. going on it is time I'll meet you outside father sir
should hope to fly into battle with you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, General. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. need that good luck out there general I believe in you general sir general general sir hey bud uh general Prophecy did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered. Enough! No matter the cost. This ends... today. If going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too, and that's where I'll be. A big, fat smile on my face. For Brock.
after Niflheim next. They're trying to shut out Ragnar. Gotta stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. to do. You three, follow. Drea. Drea, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. This way! Odin's new Valkyrie Queen is gnome. I would think so. Then we must hurry. Eyes up!
clear. Human Gander! A welcome sight! But he didn't follow us from Midgard! Curious! He'll keep Thor busy at least! Shield strike! Giants made it after all. The snake looks different. He is different. But when I was away, uh, uh, never mind, later. The Ain Heryar's link to Valhalla. My sisters and I must sever it. Go. Still no sign of the dwarves. Sindri won't let us down. We have to trust him. Mm. Rally all you can. We will make for this fall of Huntower. <laughs> The war machines. Oh, so we're pretty desperate, huh? <laughs> oh, Dwarves are dying for this! Sid, we... Save it! Oh, you force them to build those war machines! And I'm here to tear them down! We throw you fight them. We must turn them on the floor. Fine! Leave it to the dwarves to clean up after the giants!
wanted. I, I didn't want this. No. Close your heart to it. Close your heart. Who are they? My guardians. Odin took them in. They shouldn't be here. They're not soldiers. Odin put them in our path to die. It's war. Wars are won. By those who are willing to sacrifice. Everything. Why have you stopped? Ragnarok is here. We finally have Odin right where we... We will stop Odin. But we did not come to sacrifice the innocent. We will breach the wall at Hrimthor's flaw. With what army? Atreus and I will be enough. That's suicide. It may be. But we will die seeking justice, not vengeance. Can that weapon break open the flaw? Only one way to find out. You three. Get those people to safety wherever you can find it. We will see if done. Trey and I will do what we can to slow Ragnarok. He was not by us before. See if he will listen to reason. Odin will not get away. If he does, so help me. I know. Bobby! I will help those that are trapped. And leave you at the wall. Go! Go, Andreas! Sentry! Be careful and stay behind me! You be careful. I'm here to fight. <laughs> Look! Can I just say- No, you can't. Shut up and fight. Yoppa! What the hell is going on? Wood for help!
Show me. No, I just want... I don't care what you want. This changes nothing. You really had me believing you that we didn't have to be enemies. Dude, you're okay. My mom was right about you all along. You're a killer just like your father, and you're here to kill us all. No, just Odin. <laughs> Sentry, don't! She's a friend. Friends don't bring the end of the world to each other's doorstep, Loki! You're right. You're right. I, I made some bad decisions. You do that a lot. I'm not sure that's a defense. It's not a defense. I just want to make it right. Is Skilder okay? Have you seen him? Why wouldn't he be? What are you talking about? Odin is willing to sacrifice the Midgardians. He put them along the wall to try and deter us. Knowing they can't fight, their deaths are just meant to slow us down. Why would he do that? And how am I supposed to believe you? Because he's right. It's who Odin is. It's who he's always been. Mom, why are you here? What? He'll sacrifice anyone at a problem in front of him. Then the Guardians. Your friend, our family, any of us. I had hoped that your father would stand up to him, but now it, it has to be you. Mom, what are you saying? Thrude. I never doubted that you would make the finest Valkyrie these realms have ever seen. But not for him. Do you understand? That our family... Without Odin, we can be one again. A real one. What he's doing is wrong. our ground we'd be safe he said we owed him you don't owe him your death <laughs> no shit dad will never let them get the grandfather then go with him he'll listen to you are you ready to go find the rest of your people yeah. I love you, Mom. I love you, too.
Who is the girl? Hi, through uh, Thor's daughter. Thor's daughter? She's my friend.
So I trust you. I am done with you and your son. No more fucking games. And this time, I'm allowed to kill you. We do not need to do this. We do. It's what we are. It won't be enough. That it? I can take you. The line seems to be a change. Prove it and stop it. Fucking go. Wait and time.
for the sake of our children. We must be better. Why isn't he dead? Are you talking? Who told you to do that? You don't talk! You don't think! I think you kill! It's a simple fucking concept! Sif was right about you. I just didn't want to see it. What is this? Are you broken? I am your father. Take the hammer and kill who I tell you to kill! I did not want this. No! Dude, this was all their fault. They've done this to us, to our family. Looks like I gotta do everything around here. You won't start! You planned on it! What? No, it's gonna be fine! No. I saved her! And Thor! That one's on you! You turned them against me! You turned them all against me! Look oh. for help! Oh. 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 Was your plan really all that much better than mine? I hope you got exactly what you want. Not quite yet. <laughs> Think you're the only one who can craft a binding spell? I spent many long winters thinking about what I would say to you as I watched you take your last breath. But now I realize there's only one thing I need you to know. You have no hold on me anymore. That's my friend. I forgot. How good you look with wings. Oh, husband. 
You always sought knowledge well. Now, I'm going to teach you what it's like to lose everything. Bow to your queen! I always loved you, you know? You've never loved anyone! Father? Freya? You did it, Loki. No, 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 no more fighting. No, none of that matters now. This is your moment, Loki. Roa tried to hide you from me, but this is your destiny. Champion of the Jotnar. Only he can put on the mask. Only he can gaze into the truth of creation. Unfold the secrets of life and death. No more doubt, no more confusion. You were born for this. Put on the mask. Loki, ask it, ask it the question. This is your choice, son. I trust you. Use your arrow! Got it! If you Let's go! Play 
dog cart. None of this would have happened. What was it all for? Answer me! What's it all for? Our chance, Loki. I could have had my answers. I could have learned the truth. You took that away from me. I could have made things better. We could have made the Nine Realms better. This was never about the realms or me. It was about you. You destroyed everything. My home, my family, my kingdom. You did those things. Your choices. Your own son. It wasn't my choice. I had no choice. There's always a choice. You have to stop. You can choose to be better. No, I can't. I have to know what happens next. I will never stop. Why'd you have to say that? Sofna, Apra, Desu. Sofna. 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 I swore I would never rob from you the choice between life and death. I have waited so long for this moment. And now that I'm here, I don't need this to make me whole. We stopped his madness. That's all that matters.
No matter what happens, I'll be with you. But your path is your own. Follow it, and you'll end up right where you're supposed to be. Huh? There he is. Wake up, Atreus. Wake up. Glad you've come back to us. Uh, hi. Where, where is my father? Somewhere here in the Holt. He'll be glad to see you. I should find my father. Mom, stop it. I'm fine. Hush. Throat. Loki! I'm so glad you're both alive. You have no idea, and... I'm sorry. Thor, he was, he tried, you know? I'm sorry I couldn't do more. Nothing will fix what you're feeling. But I hope there's some comfort in knowing Odin's gone. There absolutely is. Loki, it was an honor to fight alongside a giant. Know that. Will you stay here in Midgard? For a bit? Then I've got something I need to find. I'm working with Hildesvini to get the rest of the Asgardians to Vanaheim. To help rebuild. Then I hope it can be a fresh start for them. And you. Oh, and Throod. I hope you find what you're looking for. Good luck. See ya, Loki. Take care. Huh, Bugen made it out. Good for him. Oh, and if you could get this wood over to Brana's tent, she killed him? Really... Loki! Hey! Glad to see the head injury didn't make you forget me. Did you have a head injury? Everything was a blur. Maybe that was someone else. Anyway, man, I I'm just... I'm... Really glad to see you. I'm glad to see you too. Looks like you're keeping busy. Ah, I'm just happy to help folks. We're on track to have bedrolls for everyone, and your friend's wolves have been helping out with hunting. We should have plenty to feed everyone. No shit. No shit? And hey, thank you for everything. We wouldn't even be here without you and your friends. Yeah, of course. I... I just wish we could have gotten more people out. Loki, you did good. Thanks. Skilder. Take care, okay? Hey, you know me. Has anyone seen any extra blankets lying around? That snow might be melting, but it's still gonna be pretty cold in this Oh, there he is. And one for the kid, too. Skull! Here, here. Skull. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. Freya's sacrifice. It's true. Well, we were just swapping our own Freyer fables. Right, right. So where was I? Oh. When we met, I was expecting this warrior, this master planner, a born leader. The legend came before the man. 
But the man himself was very different. He won me over, though. He was just so damn kind. I think it helped that he was handsome. This is true. And incredibly charming. All right, stop. Y'all are going to start crying all over again. Sorry. Gotta go find my father. Be safe, you! I'm pleased to see you awake. Freya, it was his choice. I couldn't take that from him. He saved us all. I'll never forget that. The family I thought I had was taken from me piece by piece. But there's comfort in the family I've chosen. Your mother was right, you know. You grew into that bow after all. You are a formidable warrior, but even more than that, you have a good heart. Nothing you've endured has changed that. I'm so proud of the man you've become, Atreus. Thank you. For everything. I should find my father. You should. Atreus! Oh, you gave us quite a scare there. Glad to see you too, Mimir. Listen. I want to thank you. Oh. What else did you expect from the smartest man alive? It's not just because you're smart. You listened to me. Mentored me. And... Well... You're basically another dad to me. What? No. I need you to hear it. I appreciate you so much. Uh, I love you too, little brother. See you, Mimir. It's good to see you about, Atreus. You too, Hildesvini. here, huh? No loud noises. We're okay. You did so good today, boy. I'm so proud of you. <clears throat> Maybe later, we can find some treats. Okay. My turn. Who's that, huh? Yeah, we know. <laughs> Maybe one of these days I'll surprise you. Huh? You're ready. Thank you for saving us. I decided it would be better if I wrote the ending myself. You haven't told your father yet, have you? I told him about what? Come on. Giant visions? I already saw it. I get it. Every part of me is telling me this is what I have to do. I... I just... don't know how to say it. Come with me. I've got something I want to show you. Both of you. for you too. Mm. Hmm. Atreus, I am glad you are well. I'm glad you are too.
So, what was the end of the story? What? Before Ragnarok. He promised to finish it if I fell asleep. Hmm. When death arrived, he asked why the old man had called for him. Seeing death before him caused the old man to reconsider his request. After a moment, he asked that death help him lift the logs onto his back, so that he may continue on his journey. He wasn't ready to die. He wished to keep living. There's a lot of smoke out there. Hmm. Seems when Asgard fell, pieces of it landed all over the realms. There might still be some Einherjar near them, but that's not what I brought you here to see. Mother? My shrine in Jotunheim. She destroyed it. She didn't want us to know our fate. We forged our own path because of her. She went against her own people. Our people. To protect you. I don't all open. I'm sorry. Father, I... I need to talk to you about something. There are other giants out there, and I've got to find them. I think I know where to look, but they're my responsibility. I need to do this alone. I, I don't want to do it alone, but I need to. It's hard to explain. Does it frighten you? Yeah. That is why you must do it. Like you taught me. Yeah. We survived today because of your choices. Who to trust. Who to call friend. Son. Remember our promise. Loki will go. Atreus. Atreus remains.
see in there, brother. talk about Gna. We don't need to talk about her. We just need to find her. But Odin chose her as his new Valkyrie queen. A Vanir goddess, your friend. Gna pledged loyalty to Asgard long ago, and our friendship ended soon after. What happened? I made a choice. One she couldn't accept. Kratos, she hates me. She will be a problem for us. Better we find her than she finds us. few dozen per cat. Families will stay together, obviously. Take care, Kratos. Thank you. I appreciate that. And we'll bring all the supplies we can, although it won't be much. Don't worry about it. Anyone who's able can head out for extra supplies. Aesir and Vanir. Together. Where to first? We could take care of any lingering business in the realms. 
Or investigate those pieces of Asgard. Either way, we're with you, brother. Lunda also mentioned there's going to be a get-together to honor Brock's memory at Rab's tavern in Svartalfine. I'd like to go.